Look at this, Justin! That is so crazy! And over here, look at this one! Adam, these are blowing my mind! That's right, Justin. And there's even more crazy illusions and magic tricks in this video. You won't be able to look away. Keep watching until the end, guys, because we have a crazy mystery riddle that we need your help to solve. Let's go! Hey, guys, now you can see the timer's already going. We gotta find two of the same emojis. Oh, where are they? Uh, you see them, Adam? Uh -huh. I hope there's no answer. I don't, I don't know what they are. I don't see anything so far. Wait, we're gonna, oh, I found it. I found it. I found it. No way. I where is it? it? I'm a genius, guys. Let us know at home if you're playing along. You can beat us. This one and this one. Oh, I didn't see that. That's one of my favorite emojis. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, now this one says, who's hidden here? Wow, now guys, these riddles are gonna get harder and harder, and the last one is by far the trickiest. We're gonna see if we can actually solve them. Maybe you gotta move around. Maybe you gotta get real close to the computer screen. Oh, good idea! I'm getting real close to the computer screen. All right, don't hit your head. I won't. Justin? I won't. All right, cool. You see I, don't see, I don't see anything, bro. Uh, maybe, you got, maybe you got, like, move. <laughs> guys, let us know if you're watching at home, if you, like, dance or something, if you see it. I don't see nothing. I think it might be Huggy Wuggy. What? I think it's Spider-Man, bro. All right, let's see what the answer is. Wait, what is it, bro? I don't see anything. Go what? How is this a mind trick? What's going on, bro? Yo, wait, my eyes are getting fuzzy. Wait, I do. I did see that. No way. Are those minions? I think it's a minion. Those were minions. Okay, it's another who's hidden here, guys. This is like hurting my eyeballs. I'm getting dizzy looking at this. Guys, let us know if you're seeing this. It's like an optical illusion. Wow, so guys, be careful if this hurts your head or anything, don't look. But if you look close, it feels like the lines, like something's hidden in there. I think it, this might be Kissy Massy. All right, we're gonna lock in Kissy Missy. I can't even look at this image, bro. My mind, it be beepity boopity in the computer. Is it the Squid Game doll? <laughs> I don't know. What is it? I don't see anything, bro. My brain hurts, bro. No way! It was actually Kissy Missy hidden there. Hey, that's <laughs> It says, guys, can you read this? Okay, this is pig, 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 uh, no. <laughs> Got it. Pig dig on a dig. What? How'd you get that? No, it says pig, 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 a no. All right, let's, I don't know what the answer is to this one. My Wait. brain, like, can't read the letters. Okay, oh, it's backwards. <laughs> What's so funny? Yeah, that's why I said dig. It's backwards. Let me look it upside down. Wow. I still got time on the clock. <laughs> okay, it says, okay, I got it. <laughs> I got it. It's dig pig on a dig. <laughs> That's what it says. Yeah. Dig pig on a dig. All right, let's see what the answer right, is. You say it like, yeah, like it's obvious. You didn't know. You know? All right, let's see. Or is it pig, 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 a no? Big pig on a big. <laughs> <laughs> Both so dumb. <laughs> you said dig, dig on a dig. I said dig, pig on a dig. <laughs> it's big pig on a big. Uh, yeah. <laughs> what's up? What's so funny? Are you still laughing? Dig, big pig on a big. No, I'm just thinking that the last riddle we're gonna show you guys is really, really tough. And if we can't even beat these, I'm worried. Guys, these are getting impossible. Okay, now this says real or not. Okay, so here, guys. Guys, we're gonna see an image of something and we gotta figure out is it real or is it I fake? mean how yeah that looks real it's a triangle I think this is like a computer generated trickery it's not real what you think this in the metaverse I think this is like a metaverse like fake matrix type thing why it's a triangle how is it fake so you think it's real? Yeah, why is it fake? You can't just guess that it's, you have to have a reason. Look, it has like infinite amount of sides. What? Has three sides. One, two, three. I know, but it like, it's playing like a mind trick on you. How? Cause look at the triangle. Like, I can't even explain it. It just doesn't look right. <laughs> it's just a triangle. All right, let's see what the answer is. Okay, it's better not be a metaverse. Yeah, that's real. What? <gasps> yeah, it's real. So it's real. Wow. Right? That's real, right? So that means that's real, right? Yes, yeah, so I was wrong. That means that's real, right? Whoa! What? What? Justin, are you okay? What? Somebody call a Call a <laughs> Hello? <laughs> in the metaverse. <laughs> what is that? I was wrong. Wow. Okay, this is another who's hidden in here. Uh, uh, this one's easy, bro. Okay, maybe if I actually, look at it. Actually easy. From far away. Actually easy answer. It's like a layup. 
Is you basketball. see something in there? Basketball is where you. Uh, yeah, <laughs> it's a zebra. <laughs> Duh, it's stripes. I think there's like a face hidden in there. I think it's a zebra. I think it's Pennywise. What? I see Pennywise in here. Guys, look at the lines and see if you can like wiggle your head a little bit and see if you can see uh, a face. Wiggle it, I wiggle it. You gotta wiggle faster, Justin. No, you gotta wiggle. Oh. You wiggle. <laughs> <laughs> I don't see anything. <laughs> that's what, that's, that's what I don't, that's what he wants to <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Wait, it's actually helping, guys. What are you doing? <laughs> Justin! You almost oofed. I didn't oof. Wait, I actually <laughs> saw it. Really? What is the hidden shape? Dude, it's SpongeBob. Is it? I saw SpongeBob in there. I did. I swear it helps if you wiggle did your you head. Did you see anything yet? I think it's Pennywise. <laughs> <laughs> you look like a little bobble head. <laughs> Show you what Adam looks like. <laughs> it helps you if you wiggle. Okay, it's SpongeBob, dude. Let's go. Wait, I actually see. I see a circle, guys. I see a circle. I see something there too. I, so maybe it's. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, don't. No, I, don't. I just want to lie. Cool. You lie. I see a circle, guys. I don't think it's SpongeBob. It's a circle, but I don't know what character it is. I see a circle, guys. Watch this. I knew it. It's a dragon. Wow. I, it's toothless. I saw that circle. Let's go. I was close with. SpongeBob, let's go. <laughs> Dumb. SpongeBob is Dumb. a rectangle. <laughs> Dumb, yeah. Okay, now can you read the secret message? Wow, what all right, this? guys. So, was it some sort of mathematical code? Somehow our brain might be able to like decode the, the letters and numbers in this to make a word. Decode the algorithms. Okay, so I see one five. That might be red as like is, like I S. No, red is 15, <laughs> bro. What? You got your numbers and your letters mixed. Up. I know, but I think it's like. Damn. I don't know what it is. What? In 73. <laughs> In 73 years. Okay. We will take two L's. <laughs> Can we all take L's right now? I only take W's. <laughs> I'm in the metaverse looking at this code. <laughs> Let me do the Adam Wiggle. <laughs> See if it helps. Report that. <laughs> uh, In 73 years, we'll take two L's. Wait, I think I actually cracked this one, all guys. Right, all right, Adam. All right, explain. Okay, I think the first word is intelligence. <laughs> How you get that? Wait, oh, uh, if I, yeah, if I kind of like squint, it looks like that, dude. <laughs> try that with the wiggle. <laughs> okay, it actually helps. It says all intelligence. Right, <laughs> <laughs> I tried it. It works, guys. It works. Try that at home, dude. My I'm belly not, hurts. I'm not kidding. That works, bro. It says intelligence is the ability <laughs> to adapt to changes. What? Yeah. That's deep, bro. If you guys squint, it actually, because the numbers look like letters. I get it. The seven looks like a T. Oh. And the three looks like a backwards E. Wow. Intelligence is, because that looks like I-S. The ability to. <laughs> To <laughs> adapt to change. Yeah. I think we got this. I really do. I think so too. Let's go. Let's show me show us the answer. Let's go! Wow. That was sick. Let's go. Okay, now this is real or not. I mean, it's obviously real. Like, what are these questions? I think this is fake. I think this is an optical illusion. How why? It's just some net. This is like made of paper and it's like what? an optical illusion. No, it's not. Those are screws. Those are nuts. I know. Those are made of metal. No. Nuts and bolts. They're you know? not made of metal. Nuts and bolts. <laughs> Take a close look at them. I think you extend the net further. <laughs> I do it sideways so they can see how much neck extends. <laughs> <laughs> Ow! Ow! You made me look crazy I on camera. Look, I didn't do that. Okay, guys, let's see if this is, is real how or is not. This fake, dude. How is this fake? Nuts and bolts. Okay. Wow. Okay. Yeah. So it's real. What, yeah. So you proved my point. It's real. You sure? Yeah. What do you mean? Check this out. Check out what? Okay, so it's real. Whoa! What? That's crazy. Oh, it is. It's like an optical illusion. It looks backwards, but it's forward. Yo, you see that? Wait, so am I looking backwards or forwards right now, bro? 
This is your back. But I'm looking forwards. Yeah? So am I looking backwards or forwards? Optical illusion! <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's another, can you read it? Hmm. Can you read it? Here we go. Oh, what? Only, what? I got stuck on the second word. I can read this, it. Hmm, okay, maybe it says only rats? Like if you, <laughs> if you unscramble Rich that. Rat. You think we need to call it Mickey Mouse to read this? <laughs> I think this is like a brain riddle where you have to like Obviously, unscramble. Obviously, this is all brain riddles. If you unscramble that word, it says smart. Scramble? You're talking about eggs? Smart rat no, people. I mean, you're not, you're mm. not reading this. Only Sir Matt Powelpy can, oh, I read can. <gasps> it's a secret code. You gotta read only the words that are spelled right. <laughs> That's so funny, bro. That's okay, funny. go ahead and read it. I learned this in Spy Academy. Okay, go ahead and read it then. Only can this, it, in what? The in a, are the, is that the first and last letter? No, let's hear. Be in the PC lay. <laughs> okay, what did that tell you? I just read it. I just read it. <laughs> that didn't make any sense. It, I just read it. Maybe you have to do it backwards. Okay, no problem. He's <clears throat> <clears throat> ass, watch, ass, 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 ass. I have the hell. It has all that. Well, that's us. Wait! If our, if our awesome viewers take that and rewind it, it probably says the secret code. Us, it, us, it, us, it, us, it, Dude, Adam's a genius. <laughs> guys, that's so smart. I can say stuff to you guys, and if you watch the video and rewind, it will say the message forwards. Yeah, guys, Justin is reading all these words backwards, so if you reverse the footage, it'll play it forward. That's what I'm saying, bro. We're locking that as <laughs> Well, maybe if we play what you just said reversed, it'll like have like a secret message. We could ask Foxy the editor to do it. Foxy says, I will definitely do that. Cool. In the edit. Bro, I don't I don't know what the answer is. Guys, see if you can beat this one. We're stumped. Don't like sticky, bro. Yeah, let's see what the answer is. All right, sticky, please help us out. <clears throat> Only smart people can read this. What? What? <laughs> Wait, what? Only smart people can read this. It doesn't matter what order the letters in a word are. The important thing is that the first and last letter be in the right place. Wait, so this is the answer. Wait, wait, rewind that. So they just mixed up a couple of the letters and we couldn't read it, bro. Wow, so let us know if you were able to actually, like, in your brain and, read that. And they sneak this to us, bro. It said only smart people can read this. And they didn't say geniuses. Oh! Yeah. Yeah, could a smart person do this? <laughs> 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 oh, okay, now this one I could do is says find a panda. Okay. <laughs> so somewhere hidden in this is a panda. Do you see it, Justin? <laughs> Let me look. This one's not getting by me. It's probably a trick question. Yeah, it could be anywhere. You see it? You guys can see where Justin's mouse is. That's where his eyes are right now. Let's see if he can find the panda. <laughs> Where's the kung fu panda? Stop! Hold on, I'm noticing there's an error because there's people missing here. Maybe the panda ate them. <laughs> I'm in the panda verse. Okay. Okay, guys, let us know if you know where panda is. Let's go. There's the panda right there. Guys, my stomach has never hurt so much. <laughs> After filming a video, then right now. Dude, I noticed there's some clones, some duplicates in here. One of them might be a panda in disguise. <laughs> bro, because look, there's clones, bro. Wow. One, two, same person. Okay, I think I know where it is. I can try to give you a hint. This is a small one. Okay, bottom right corner. <laughs> it wasn't a hint. <laughs> There's the panda! I found it! <laughs> I found it! With only a very small hint. All by yourself. Yep, thanks. Okay, guys, we've reached the max level. And this is kind of spooky. It says, what do you see first? What do you see first? I see a buddy rabbit. I see Mr. Hops, bro. Or is it Manny from Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach? Okay, I see a bunny rabbit, too. I think it's Mr. Hops, but there apparently is a second image hidden in here. Now, guys, this is the secret riddle. If you're able to just see it immediately, then you are actually a genius, because I don't see it. There's a something hidden in here is what you're saying? Get off me. If you look upside down, it's a man with a mustache. Wait, keep looking, keep looking. If you look upside- Hey! I sat on him! No! I sat on him! Hit it! 
mustache. It's a man with a mustache. I must ask you a question. Uh, is wow. There, is, there, is there a third image? Maybe it's Maybe like. Maybe do the wiggle. Uh, uh, I think it's a guy. Guys, let us know if you see any other images hidden in this secret puzzle. There's a guy with a mustache. If you guys flip the image, if you look at it, I don't know if I see anything else, man. Okay, so if you see a rabbit first, you're full of energy and usually feel happy. That, I saw a rabbit first. That's us. That's great. So if you guys see that, like me, oh, you're full of energy and feel happy. That's good. Cool. A beard of man means if you see that first, you are lit. <laughs> <laughs> wow. How many faces do you see in this picture? Okay, well, it's what? It's Abraham Lincoln. Wait, He's wait. He's on the $20 bill. But I think I see another face already. No, you don't. Wait, turn your head like this. Go like this. And then look at the bottom of the you picture. You do it again? And then look at the bottom of the picture. What are you talking about? Look at his body. <laughs> it's, not, it's just his No, head. I didn't say look at his booty. I said look at the bottom of the picture. I didn't say that either. Look right here. Huh? See? Move your mouse here. Yeah. You see that? Like, look at it from the side. Oh, it's a guy. That's the eyeball. That's the chin. So there's like faces hidden in this picture. There's probably more. Okay, there's, I see at least two faces. Wait, 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 wait. I think I might see another one. No, you don't. Yeah, yeah. Look, no, look, look. No, right you here. You see that face? That's a face. Bro. That's three already. So guys, play along with these optical illusions. See how many you can find. Wait, I see another one. No way. There's an upside down face right here, bro. Do a handstand. Do a handstand. You'll see it. Do it. I tried doing a handstand do the other do day. Do a handstand. Do a handstand. I can't. You can do it. No, you can't. That's not a handstand. I you can't. You learn this in gymnastics class. Do it. I can't do a handstand. Do a handstand. <laughs> I can do one. Do one. Okay, show me. No, you do a handstand. <laughs> do a handstand. Foxy can do one. Milky can do one. Do a handstand, bro. Meanwhile, I'm looking at the picture. <laughs> I see at least two faces right now, guys. I might be up. What are you doing? Can you cut that part from the video? I says, I will definitely <laughs> cut that out of the video. You promise to remove that. Stop messing around. I'm looking at the faces, bro. All right, what else do you see? All right, guys. There's at least, I says, one Abraham Winter. <laughs> another one here. Two, three, four. I think there's another upside down one. Like, that's someone else's mouth. If you look upside down. Where? Like, those are the eyes. Do you see yes. that? No, you're making stuff up. I see four faces. Is there four? I see four faces right now. Wow, guys, I think we're gonna lock in that there's... Okay, Justin's I gonna... See, I see four faces. Well, I wasn't able to see any faces because Justin just spanked me, I but... didn't do that. <laughs> I didn't do that. Play back the footage, it wasn't me. <laughs> Box. Maybe if Justin's able to do a handstand, then then we'll be able to see the other no face. No problem. Justin, you're gonna hurt yourself. No problem, guys. You're gonna oof yourself. Justin, here, I'll help. I'll help. <laughs> Justin! <laughs> Justin! <laughs> you dropped me on purpose! No, I didn't! I know how to do a handstand, guys. I've done it in gymnastics class many times. I see four faces. All right, we're gonna lock in four. I see four. And this, uh, this is not a game. This life or oof. Okay, that's one, obviously. That's two. We saw that one. All right. Three. Yep. And there's one right there. Four. Please tell me it's four. Four. Come on. It's four. Yeah, we did it! We got it right! Let's go! How many animals are in this image? Okay, now I see obviously an elephant. Obvious is one. So there's an elephant. I see like a horse. Yeah. yeah. So there's two. Horse. I see a doggy. <laughs> there's a dog there. I see a kitty cat. Cat and a mouse. And a mouse. And that's it. Nope. There's a gorilla. Oh. And this might be a snake. 
<laughs> yeah, that might be a snake. And the eye of the elephant might be a clam. What? And maybe the, the little rabshees on the elephant's nose What's is a, worms. Hey, can you explain what rabshees <laughs> And the little squiggly lines on the front. How do you say squiggly as rabshees? These might be wormies. They could be wormies. And this could be like a hot dog. Hey, while you're messing around, I'm doing science. <laughs> I think this is a bunny rabbit <laughs> if you look upside down. Really? Yeah. I think it's a bunny rabbit. Really? Yeah. What if you look at it from the other way? Okay. <laughs> I'll get you back for that one. Uh, you already got no, me. I just know the baby bowies. We're gonna, we're gonna get you back later. <laughs> just watch. All right. What is this, bro? Okay, so we have to count elephant. Horsey, doggy, kitty, mousey, gorilla. I think there's only six, right? No, you said there's wormies. Oh yeah, the worms. How many is this? Four worms? Four worms. The clam for the eye. Then the snake that you found. Then the hot dog I found. You found a hot dog? <laughs> Where'd you find that? Right here. There's a hot dog. Now I'm hungry. <laughs> uh, I think that's it. Unless like the tail is something. How many is that? <laughs> Uh, <laughs> seven? I don't know. I lost count. You think a tail's an animal? It could be a snake. That might be a snake. Snake! Yeah. Elephant's got a snake on his booty. <laughs> Maybe. There's another snake here then. And another one here. And another one here. And another one here. Okay, Justin. Count how many there are then. At least four. <laughs> <laughs> That's a lot of snakes. No, I mean animals total. All right, we're going to lock in four animals. No, I said at least elephant, horsey, doggy, kitty, mousey, gorilla. I think six is a safe answer. Okay, let's see what the answer is. Oh, it's six! We actually got that right. Wait, now it's level two. It's like the same image, but it's different. Oh, there's way more animals, bro. Okay, so there's the elephant, the donkey, the dog, the cat, and the mouse. That's five, but That's there's... Five. Even more hidden in here. There's a fishy! Oh, a fish for the eye! It's like Big Shark's friend. Wait, guys, look. The ear of the elephant looks like a turtle. I see turtle. I like turtles. Th that's seven. I think the crease right there, that's like a mosquito. What? Look at that. That's like a mosquito. That's a mosquito. That's eight. <gasps> Do you see the, the crocodile? There's an alligator on its mouth. That's nine. This is shark. That's like a whale. It might be Big Shark, bro. That's ten. Look at the tail! It's actually a snake! That's eleven. Wow. And then this kind of looks like the mouth of like a, a bird or something. Yeah, the white part looks like its own thing. That's like a bird. Wow. So that's like 12 animals hidden in there. I think it's only 12. I think my mom's coming. Huh? <laughs> you mess with me twice? <laughs> Just know, later, give me two diapers on you. So somehow, we're going to make it happen. Alright, whatever. whatever. You mess with the wrong guy. <laughs> so how many animals are there? I lost count. I think there was 11. Unless this is some sort of undiscovered animal. Yeah, like a boomerang or something. Was that a snail? <laughs> I think it's a snail, yeah. I don't know how many. I'm going to lock in 11. Okay, Jess is going to lock in 11. One more time. Count on your hands. Don't lose count. Alright, here we go. Elephant. One. Snake. Two. Turtle. Three. Fishy. Four. Shark. Five. Alligator. Six. Donkey. Seven. Dog. Eight. Cat. Nine. Mouse. Ten. Mosquito. Eleven. 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 And let's see what the answer is. Oh! Let's go! We have to find the entire alphabet hidden in here. I don't see it. What do you mean? Uh, okay. Well, A, if you turn your head this way, I oh, think... you could turn your head. Yeah. So trace the okay, A. Okay, I think that's A. a. That's A right there. That's A. Okay. Let's try to find B. B is it's right here, guys. Ah, uh, where? Oh, it's Why B. do you do it's, that it's with B, your it's tongue? B, it's B right there, bro. <laughs> Help me think. <laughs> Help me think. Oh, okay. I'm I got gotcha. you. The equation of the Earth's rotation. I got it. I got That's it. That's what I did. It's B right there. B. Okay. Where's C? C. Anywhere. C. Or like here. That's a C. Okay. Right there. D. D. Right there. E. Boom. E. Okay. Right. And then F also F. works there. F. G. G is going to be trickier. Well, G is just like the circle and then right here. Well, G golly. You're just randomly tracing lines. And the H obviously is here. Right? The I. It's just a straight line. Yeah. J. That's me. J for Justin. Big J. Big J. J. K. Big J. K. KFC. K. 
Wow. Right there? I think so, yeah. Then what's after that? L. But we don't take L's, ever. I don't take L's. <laughs> okay, where's the L? L is probably right here. That's the L. Hmm, all right, let's see what the answers are you or if we're up? right. I give up. You give up? I'm giving up. You give up? Yes. Yo, what letters I see in here? What? I see you. I see you what? Hey, Adam. <laughs> Adam, can you, uh, real quick, can you spell I cup? I cup? Like I C U P? <laughs> Why? Stop, baby Boxy. <laughs> I don't get it, guys. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't even. What is the joke? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe do another handstand. It'll make sense to you, bro. I have to do another handstand. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. And then when you're upside down, think about uh, what I cup looks like upside down. You're not gonna embarrass me I will, again. How I would embarrass you, bro. All right, hold Boxy's right, diaper. I got you, bro. I All got right, you, bro. Now you're my best friend, so I trust you. Yeah. Okay? Think about I cup upside down, bro. All right. <laughs> Sorry. You don't even know how to do a handstand. Well, guys, <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Okay, he's really committed to doing the handstand, even though that was over. Okay. <laughs> You're gonna remove that from the video too, right? For what? For what? None of this should make it onto actual Did YouTube. Did you think about it? Did you learn the alphabet while you were thinking there? No, I don't get it. Oh, well, one day it'll make sense to you, Adam. One day. What will make sense to me? Nothing. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Okay, see, hey, we found that. Oh, that's the B. Okay, well, we found one, too. Oh. There's C. Okay, this is almost as far as we made it. There's D. Yep. Nice. Hey, guys, we would have found all these if I had known the letters past J. Easy, dude. Oh, there's F. Yeah, we found that, basically. There's G. Yep, we found that. H. Okay, sure, but mine was cool, too. I, it's just a letter I. Easy. Nice. J, there's where we stop. Let's go. J for Justy. Wow. This game is cool, guys. Let us know if you can actually find anything. I just want to know what this squiggly's for. This yeah. M. That's an upside down W. That's tricky. And, yep, got that. Oh, yeah, that was obvious. <laughs> Easy. P. Yep, yep, yep. R is just that with this. Q. Whoa. Q between P and R. Yep. What's the squiggly for? S. It's just there to throw you off. I think so, yeah. T, where's the U? Okay, U, okay, sure. I smile, you smile, you know, W. X, Y, Z. What's the, what's the squiggly for? It's just to mess you up. It's literally just to mess you up, yeah. why they do that, bro? Wow, there's all the letters. Okay, now we have to decide which emoji is fake. I think it's the one on the left. You think that's fake? No, that looks real. I think I, your mom sends that one to you all the time when you ask for more milk on text. I think she sends the one on the right. We're always gonna ask, like, can we get more cookies? And then she always send, hmm. No. And then she says, no. no. Adam says, I need some more milk. <laughs> In the group chat, and she sends this one. <laughs> Why? Because she says, stop it, Adam. You already had enough. Oh, all right. Let's I think see. this one's fake. Wait, this is a real emoji? I don't know. All right, fake. let's say the one on the left. Let's go! All right. Okay, next round. Easy. <gasps> okay. Oh, this is tricky. One of these is real? Yeah. I think the one on the left is real. I just send um, the smiley one. Yeah, Justin loves that emoji. Or I send the clown one? Right. Because your mom always sends that one to us. Right. Yeah. I'll be like, oops, Adam's mommy. I accidentally dropped the iPad <laughs> in the toilet. And she'll just send four clown emojis. <laughs> Yeah, I've, I've read the group chat, guys. It's pretty embarrassing. Yeah. <laughs> Real splashage. Yeah. 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 She does not like it. Or I'll say, like, um, <laughs> hey, hey, the mommy. Uh, 
I had my Happy Meal, but then Adam dressed up as Bruno and pranked me. And she'll send like 20 clown emojis. Yeah, I think she's roasting us. I don't know. Wait, I've never seen either of these. I'm gonna guess this one's fake, because it has like this. It doesn't look real. Let's see. I think the one on the right is fake, guys. I think the one on the left's real, yeah. Yeah, I think it's real. All right, let's see. It seems like whichever one has more stuff is usually fake. Right. <gasps> Let's go! Cool! All right, we got that one right. Round three, let's go. It's getting harder and harder, guys. Oh boy. I actually have no idea. What? I, I'm thinking the one on the right is real. You think this one's fake? Yeah. Yeah, you also send this one when you say, is it time for milk? <laughs> yeah. Let's go! Cool. What's so funny? All right, That's let's so see what's funny. next. Okay, this is hard. This one I have no idea. Wait, one of these is fake? They're the same. Oh, it's the thermometer. <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny, bro. Yeah, whenever me and Justin get sick, so we always fun. have to get the thermometer. I don't get sick. <laughs> yeah, you do. No, nah, I'm sick. <laughs> but I don't get sick. Yeah, sometimes you get like, like tummy I aches. sick scooter moves. No. Oh, all right, all right, all right. You get all right. sick. All right, all right. Mommy, all, right all right, all right, all right, all right. Mommy, mommy, I need the thermometer. <laughs> That's what he says, bro. I think the fake one's on the right. Yeah, I think the right one. I think this one looks real. I would remember this one. It looks like an otter pop. Yeah. This if, one. If you guys are watching on like a phone or an iPad, you can actually check which one's real. Let's go. We're three for three. Wow. We're good at this, dude. Round four. Now, this is the hardest one, dude. Hardest one right here. Come on. Oh, bro. I actually have no idea. Wait, without looking at your phones, guys, which one is real? Which one's fake? I don't know. It's the mouth. I think the one on the left is right. Are these real? They have this as emoji? Yeah, it's like the Pinocchio one. Oh, your mom sends this one too. Yeah, she'll send this and then she'll say cap. Which I don't really know. When yeah. we say, like, we'll text her that we got yeah. girlfriends, and then she'll send this. I don't text her And that. then she says, Cap. I don't text her that. <laughs> you text her that, bro. We both text her that, dude. All right, all right, all right. I think so the Adam, one on the left. Adam will send two texts. First will be, I got a girlfriend. Second is, I don't need diapers. <laughs> and she sends it. <laughs> Somebody's capping. <laughs> All right, let's see. Let's see what the answer is. <laughs> oh boy. Whoa, we didn't even lock it in. <laughs> I locked in the one on the left. You think this one's fake? The one on the left is real, so the one on the right. Oh, is I fake. think the one on the right is fake. Yeah. yeah, yeah. All right, here we go. <laughs> Yeah! Whoa. Whoa! We're good! We're good at this! Okay, this says, how much can you trust your yeah. eyes? Which triangle is right in the middle? Oh, so some of these are, like, not in the middle. Yeah, I think the one on the right is in the middle. I think this one's in the middle. Yeah, because, like, if you look at, um, like, a donut, the hole is always right in the middle, and so, yeah, you can just tell. What are you doing? If I, yep, 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 yep. If I jump right and left really fast, I'll be able to see where the middle is. This one's in the middle. Wow. And I eat a lot of donuts. Let Foxy the donut expert look. She says, yep, it's the one on the right. All right, I think we got that one right. I'm pretty sure it's this one. It's in the middle. Come on. Okay, yep, it was off. Let's go. Wow. We're geniuses. Guys, let us know if you guys got that one at home. Let's see what else it is. Okay, which cell is in the very center? So which of these squares is in the very center of the square without counting? I don't know. I think I know. This one. What? I was gonna say the purple one. It's not this one? No, mm. that one's way off to the right. I gotta get my glasses <laughs> checked. Yeah, you really do. I got 20-20 vision. Yep. I got 20-22 vision. <laughs> We're in 20-22, I got a vision. Right, he's got 20-30 vision because Justin's always looking I'm in the future. I'm in 20-30 right now. Right. I think it's the purple square. This one? Yeah, I think that's right in the middle. Okay, we'll see. That's the foxy colored square. Yeah. Or is it the thick shark colored square or the boxy colored square? Or the sticky green colored square. Guys, make your predictions. Is I it purple? It's, I think it's purple also. Is it the purple square? <gasps> it's the purple square! Nice job! Okay, it says, can you read this? All right. What? No, I can't read that. Okay, the first letter is B. I'm pretty sure it's B. Guys, what does this say? Let us know in the comments. B, R. Where's the R? R is the next letter. How? Where? It's somewhere in there. Oh, like this? Yeah. Oh, yeah. B, R, A. A? I. Where'd you get an I? I think I see it in there. Guys, let us know if you're following along. I think the word might be brain. No, I don't see an I. I think it's bran. Yeah, like raisin bran. Raisin bran. That's the cereal your mom makes us eat. Yeah. When 
I eat all the cinnamon toast crunch. Right. Where's their eye? Is it brain or brain? I'm a lock in brand. All right, let's see what it is. Like that's a brand new <clears throat> right. merch. Yeah. Brand new. Oh. It was brain! Wow. There's a snake somewhere in this photo. Do you see it? Wait. Guys, right look there. close. It's right there. It's right there. No, that's, that's a leaf of grass. That's what? not a snake. That's just grass. How do you know? Oh, I see sticky. Sticky. Grass. I feel like this is going to be one of those things where once you see it, you won't be able to unsee it. But it's really hard to actually see. Guys, there's no snake in here. We're getting trolled. Is that the snake right there? It has his mouth open? I don't see it. Huh? Where is it? Maybe you got to turn upside down. Yeah? Okay. Try like moving your head really quickly back and see me. <laughs> <laughs> you got What was that? Oh, uh. Something hit me. Do you see that? No, I didn't see anything. You look over here? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> what is that? It's invisible. It's your. <laughs> Maybe check the floor? Huh? <laughs> 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 I can't I can't even think straight anymore. Wow. I actually don't see the snake though. I, I can't even think straight anymore. I'm thinking we might need to just reveal the answer. Stop. I'm looking for the snake, dude. I can't I'm seeing all sorts of stars and stuff. I bonked my head on something. Yeah, I don't know how that happened. These are sticks, leaves. Looks like sticky. Our friend. Oh yeah, they're sticky. I don't see any snake, bro. It's gonna be really obvious. I'm gonna feel like a dummy when I see it. Let's see it. <sighs> they gotta count us down. I don't see the snake anywhere, bro. Is it even in here? I, maybe it's a stick bug. Maybe, Let's, yeah. I see the stick bugs. Oh, now I see it! I actually see it, guys. It's right there. Do you guys see that? Wow! It was literally in the middle of the picture. Are you kidding me? Yeah, so the snake's oh. eye is right there. Yeah. The snake's eye? What? It's over here. That's his head. Wait, what? Hold on. I thought what this talking? was the snake's eye. No. Isn't that the head of the snake? No, dude. The snake is like an S, and it has a bunch of little triangles on it for camouflage. Yeah, I see that. Where's his head? His head is over here. Yeah. Yeah, that's the head. Wow. Apple Queen decided to get rid. Uh oh. What? What's she getting rid of, bro? Oh. Of her daughter in law. Why would you do that? She's evil. Oh, that makes sense. She decided to poison the apples, bro. There's three apples. Oh. She poisoned two of them that the princess was about to have for breakfast. All right, she poisoned two of the apples. But the amount of poison turned out, what did it turn out to be, man? To be only sufficient for two apples. So she poisoned two apples, bro. All right, makes sense. Okay, let's go, dude, let's go. Which apple is safe, bro? All right, what? so we're gonna look at five riddles, including a Mirabelle and Canto riddle. Now, let's Let's see if Justin can solve this. Hold on, let me just rewind this dude. Easy, let me just <laughs> <laughs> rewind that, bro. All right, let me watch. She poisoned left, middle. Okay. Okay, keep your eyes on the prize, guys. Keep your eyes on the apple, left, middle. But then she did a quick little shuffle and I lost them. All right, let's see if Justin can track them. So this one's the, the clean one. Uh-huh. Right, obviously. Okay. This one's the clean one. Boom, it's right there. Now guys, this riddle is pretty tricky. You gotta look real close in order to see the answer. Is one of them like different with the reflections or the leaves? This one got like a weird sticker on it. You know how sometimes you get apples from the store they got a sticker on it? Yeah. It's this one. I saw the way it moved, bro. Like it was like this, like this. Like we got three apples. She poisoned the two and then she went boop. <laughs> it's, I know which one it is. It's this one. You sure that's a sticker? Why are you keep asking, bro? All right, Justin's gonna lock in the middle apple. Let's see what the answer hey, is. Let's go. It's obvious. Guys, I literally watched it go. Like, what do you mean, bro? All right, let's see what the answer I'm is. I'm a genius, bro. That's easy. Give me my ding. Got the first one right. And the next riddle is? Uh, uh, uh. Mm. The answer is what? that one because there's a worm in it. The worm is alive, so it must be safe. That's a worm? Yeah. I thought that was a smiley sticker. <laughs> okay, now this is a max level Encanto riddle. Young, I am tall. Old, I am short. I love to go. Breath is my fart. <laughs> 
What? That's gross. No, it says breath is my foe, like my enemy. Okay. Yeah, so I love to glow, breath is my foe. So it's like afraid of breath. I love to breath. glow, breath is my foe. Is this a nursery rhyme? <laughs> a little goo goo ga ga. It is a riddle. Now, guys, this is a Mirabelle riddle. This one's gonna be tricky. This one is real difficult, guys. I picked this one. Mm. I don't think Judd is gonna be able to solve it. Okay, young I am tall, old I am short. That's the Biggest clue. Young, I am tall. Old, I am short. What's tall when it's young and then short when it's old? I'm not going to give you any hints. I actually don't know. I was thinking tree, but it's not a tree. Right. Trees get taller as they get older. That's what I'm saying. Hmm. Unless it's a shrinking tree, a magic tree. Why is Mirabelle here is the real question, bro. I don't know. Maybe that has something to do with it's the riddle. It's a flower, bro. Young, because, I am tall. Yeah, because flowers, they like shrivel up when they get super old. Like they've been in the sun for too long. They love to glow. Flowers glow. Not and really. Breath is my foe. Because if you pick a dandelion, Adam always goes and it blows everywhere. I'm a genius. It's flowers. Wait, but a flower doesn't glow. I love yeah, to does. glow. They glow up. Uh, so you always say, Adam always walks around the house saying, Mommy, I'm glowing up. Flowers love to grow. That's what I'm saying. But not glow. So it's not a flower? I'll give you a hint. You're wrong. <laughs> Dude, I actually got it! I actually, I'm so smart, dude. It's so funny. What is it? I'm so smart, bro. Guys, let us know if you're playing along at home. I actually know the answer. I'm gonna say it in three, two, one. It's a candle. Yeah! It's a candle because think about it, guys. Young, I am tall. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Because when you first get a new candle, it's long, right? Then when you light it and use it, it gets shorter. It loves to glow and breath is its foe because it puts the candle out. Dude, that was so hard. I only got that because Mirabelle was here. Because I was thinking about what Mirabelle has, like the butterflies. Got, I was thinking, is a butterfly tall or short? And then I thought about the candle. If Mirabelle wasn't here, I wouldn't have got that. So thank you to Mirabelle, dude. Wow, that gets a ding. Let's move on. Okay, now this riddle looks more easy. It says, what's wrong? I mean, obviously there's something wrong here. These people are floating in space. Well, they're swimming. Now guys, play along at home. Let us know if you guys see anything. I'm looking very close what's wrong. I'm looking in the direction people are swimming. I'm trying to make sure everyone has goggles, not to be confused with Googles. <laughs> Google is what you use to look at the internet. The goggles, you gotta make sure you protect your eyes. Right. They all have goggles. Okay. Okay, they all look good. Nice, so something is wrong in this picture, guys. What? What is it? See if you can solve this before Justin does. I'm checking, they all got good form. They're all doing what we call crawl stroke. Uh-huh. So it looks like Adam when he's crawling on the ground. <laughs> she does do. <laughs> Let me look, guys. Let me look. I don't know. Uh... You got to look real close for this one. That's what I'm doing, bro. I don't see. Okay. Maybe it has to do with like their breathing technique. They're all open mouth. They shouldn't have their mouth open when they're swimming, bro. The water's going to get in. Mm, I don't know. Is that what's wrong? Is that the answer? No. Mm. There's, there's something wrong with one of these people. Oh, it's just one. Yeah. So, guys, look close. See what you can see. I got it, dude. What is it? There's two of these, bro. There's two she of everyone. Used the clone. What? There's two of everyone. They just flipped the image. Man. It's tricky, tricky. Is that what's wrong? There's like a mirror here. I just noticed. Yeah, it's flipped, bro. Now the timer's going down. Oh. Stop, 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 stop. I got it. No way. This dude's wearing a hat. Exactly. Why is he wearing a hat when he's swimming? Yeah. Wait, but maybe it's like one of those fancy hats that swimmers wear to go faster. You know what I mean? But this looks like a winter hat. No, it looks like a fancy swimming hat. Swimming hats don't have the ball on the top, I'm though. gonna lock that in, dude. I think it's the hat, bro. All right, let's see. Let's go! Nice! Okay, Derek went to elementary school. Okay, look looked like Aiden going to school, okay? His mommy... Gave him a hamburger for lunch. That lucky Derek. All right. But he disappeared from his bag each time. Oh, yikes. Okay, Derek, you ate it, bro. When Derek stayed hungry once again. What? <laughs> he got angry and decided to track down the thief. Someone's stealing his lunch, man. Exactly. That's messed up. The next day, he left his bag in the classroom. Okay, somebody about to steal his burger. Walked out the door and laid low. All right, let's see. He saw somebody pulling the hamburger out of his bag. Oh, boy. But he didn't see his or her face. Well, what was the point of that then, Derek? Derek decided to ask everyone about the stolen burger. So one of these people stole the burger. Okay, it's right there. We'll see. How is that not the answer? It's this guy. You got to keep watching. Oh, wait, they all have what? 
How can you think that of me? Well, I don't know, Ross. You have a burger. <laughs> this is my burger. Yeah, right, Ross. Yeah, right. Okay, she got a salad. I only eat salad, said Betty. Hmm. Likely story. David, my mom made this burger for me. That What? All right, so there's three people. Can Justin beat this? Now, guys, this is probably one of the toughest riddles I have ever seen. If Justin's able to get this, I will literally be shook. Okay, we have to find out who stole the hamburger? Exactly. Was it Beatty, Ross, or David? I have no idea. How am I supposed to figure this out? Now, this one requires you to go back in the riddle and be like super detective mode. All right, let me go back, dude. Let me go back. All right. You think it might have to do with the mom? You said doo doo? Doo mom, I'm my He said. <laughs> <laughs> maybe, <He> said, <laughs> <laughs> maybe it has to do with the mom. <laughs> Why do you get so flustered when you talk about the mom? <laughs> Just chill, Adam. It's not your mom. I know. Okay. At first, I was actually a genius big brain. I thought it was the dog. Because <laughs> <laughs> the doggy would steal the hamburger. Okay. And he do look hungry, doesn't he? Yeah, there's the burger. Wait, I see it, dude. Look at the burger. It matches the one that was stolen. What do you mean? Okay, look. There's no lettuce. It's just bun, tomato, cheese, patty, right? Yeah. Okay, fast forward to the end. It matches this burger, bro. It, that, it doesn't look like Ross. Ross got the lettuce. You know what I mean? How would you give me a, a riddle about burgers? You think I wouldn't get it? That's right. Let's go. Look at the answer, guys. Let's this is go. crazy. Let's go, dude. Let's go. I knew it was this guy. And he's trying to hide it behind a book. I thought this would take you like weeks to get. This is a riddle about food. You thought I wouldn't get it? When I played it before, it took me like 10 hours to get. Well, well, well. Probably because you're looking at the salad. <laughs> thinking about the mom. <laughs> I knew it was David. Look at David, bro. You know how I knew it was David? How? They remind me of you. Wow, so yeah, you guys can see Ross's burger has lettuce on it. So that's how you can tell that they, it's not the they burger. They reminds me of Adam, dude. He dresses like Adam, he steals my food, and he pretends to read. And we all know he doesn't. <laughs> we all know that book is not doing anything, David. You're not reading. Okay, here's the answer. Hey, Derek didn't have lettuce. I knew that, bro. Obviously. Yeah. Yup, David stole the burger. All right, next riddle. Okay, now this one says, I am something in disguise that seems to shine at night. However, I am not a star. I am Earth's satellite. Okay, and we got an image of the sun and moon boss from the game. Now, guys, this one's real tricky. Let's see if Justin's my, my giant brain is able to beat it. What is happening to your English, bro? It's going to the <laughs> I just want to see if you can solve this riddle. Okay, it's something in the sky that shines at night. Could be anything. No, nah, it could be one of two things. You think maybe it's like a unidentified... <laughs> <laughs> okay, I wasn't thinking about it. It could be one of three things. It could be a UFO. Oh, could be that. I mean, the background is green. It could be that. <laughs> you laughed? Because that was abducted. <laughs> and they conducted experiments <laughs> on my brain. <laughs> All right, it might be that. Could be that. Or it could be Adam's nightlight, because that, <laughs> that shines at night, and it's not a star. That's true. Or it could be stars. Okay, wait, it's not a star. Okay, so it's not that. Ooh. Something in the sky that shines at night. What shines at night in the sky? Hmm. Your nightlight. But my nightlight isn't in the sky. It's in the wall. Okay. Good point. Yeah. So it must be you. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna lock that in. I'm gonna lock that in. Does that make sense? Yeah. You wanna lock your UFO? Wait, why is it Sun Moon Boss? Why are they holding hands, bro? Because they're friends. They would probably be able to figure out this riddle pretty quick. Okay. Well, it's not the sun because the sun doesn't shine at night. Is it the moon? Wait. I'm mean, something in the sky that shines at night. Okay. A, a moon. However, I'm not a star. The moon is not a star. It's technically a rock. Rocky. In his family, actually. It's made of cheese. What? I always thought the moon was made of cheese. You got cheese on your brain again. <laughs> no, the moon's not made of cheese. Oh, I don't know. That's Jupiter. Oh, my bad. And I'm not a star. I'm Earth satellite. It's the moon. The moon goes around the Earth. Ding, 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 ding. Okay, they're driving a car. What are they doing? What are they doing? How is this magic? Huh? What? Oh, oh! What? It was a tiny house. 
Wait, it's a giant car or a tiny no. house? Wait, but they just got out of the house. Bye, babe. What? Wait, what? The car's small here, the house is big, but then it's a tiny house and a big car. Whoa! Oh, I know how they did this. He ran out of the house, he got in the car, uh -huh. and he drank a grow potion. <gasps> oh! They drank a grow potion, and then they backed over their house. Duh. <laughs> wow! Easy. <laughs> <laughs> you guys want to see a trick? Can you just give us some candy? Uh, just check this out. <laughs> <laughs> That's smart that he took all the candy. <laughs> <laughs> what was that, bro? How do you do that, bro? <laughs> Look, then he takes their candy. Wow, now Justin, how do you think he did this magic trick? You wanna see a magic trick? Yeah. Whoa! Bro, I just did it right there, bro. That was cool. See that, bro? So if I were to do it right now, if I had like a pink shirt on, I would go like this. Oh, and it looked like I'm blending in, bro. Oh, so if your shirt matches the background, then it'll yeah. look like you're invisible. Yeah. Go ahead. Next. Okay, they're at the airport. Okay, that sounds fun. Hey, you might need this. Have a good trip. Oh. Oh. What? Next. It was a gorilla. Next. Hey, it's a perfect loop. Whoa. Have a good trip. He just opened a door to a jungle! And there's a monkey! <laughs> <laughs> wow, wait, how is that possible? First he took the blade from there. How do you do that? He opened a door, a portal, to another dimension! Guys, let us know how you think these magic tricks are done. I, I mean, do you know how they did this one? I think he's a wizard and that's he's casting a spell to a portal. Oh! The only, only explanation makes sense to me. Yeah. Or maybe it's magnets. It's a magnet door. Yeah, Tesla magic. <laughs> Elon magnet. <laughs> yeah. True. Whoa! Oh, it's a statue. <gasps> it's not a statue. He's alive. It's a robot. Well, that was, wow. that, that was easy. It's a robot. Well, I think that's a real person. What? That's a real guy. Am I a real guy or am I a robot? Check it out. Beep, beep, boop, 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 boop. No, you're a real Justin. Beep, boop, boop, boop. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm a robot. Dude, what is that? It's a statue. If that was a real person, how could you see through him? That doesn't even make sense. Oh, I have an idea. What is it? So you know how they have those like um, really cool like spy pens that write in invisible ink? Yes. Maybe he put a bunch of invisible ink on his tummus. On his, oh. on his, on his stomach. You try to get some food for your Thomas? <laughs> you think a Thomas the tank engine? No, his his stomach area, so that it turned it invisible. I actually listened to his Thomas. <laughs> so he's filled with milk. <laughs> milky milk, milky milk, got milky Thomas. Okay. It's a donut. No way. Huh? What? He's in the newspaper. He jumped out of the newspaper. He stole the donut. <laughs> How? Wow! How'd he do that? So yeah, you guys can see he's in the newspaper and then he brings the donut into the newspaper. What? Mm. How? I think I know how this works, dude. You know how every, you go to the library, you get like a flip book? Yeah. Like you open it and a little thing pops up? Yeah, like a 3D book. That's like this, bro. Oh! See? I solved it. Wow. That's magic. Okay, what's this? He's got an airplane. Okay. Got an airplane. Whoa! That was pretty cool. Yeah, toy plane. Wait, it's gonna hit him. It's not. Oh! It went from being a toy plane to being a huge plane. Wait, so at the start, it's about that big. Yeah. Then he throws it in the sky, and then now it's the size of an actual airplane. How is that possible? What is that? How? So cool. Maybe the airplane had a grow potion also. It just grew bigger. Yeah, maybe something like that. Dude, airplane. Hair plane. What does hair do? It grows. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and what does this look like when Justin T bows it? Airplane. <laughs> we cracked the case at 
Jacob. Wow. Okay. Whoa. Cannonfall. They're jumping in leads. I love doing that. And they're coming out the other side. Cannonfall. It's also a perfect loop. No, it's not. Cannonfall. The person swept away the lead and they couldn't come out on the other side. Oh, no way. I know how this one was done. How? I know, I know how this one was done. Break it down. Pretty easy. I think what he did was under the leaves, there's a tunnel. He dug a hole through the whole planet. So he's coming out from the other side of the planet. Oh, so it's kind of like how hamsters have those tubes they can walk in. There's like a tube going under the ground that he's diving in and then tubing his way up. And what site are we on right now? YouTube. What? <laughs> I'm in a tube right now. It's like tubes when Adam goes to the McDonald's play place. Yeah, exactly. I think that's what there is. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> There's like an underground tube. Hey, we can't say this, bro. This is r restricted by the government. We can't be saying this. This is secrets. Okay, Foxy. Foxy, can you edit this out? Yeah. All right. Oh, some skateboarding. Whoa. All right, Zach, see what you got. Okay. Okay. Woo. Solid board slide. That's nice. What? He turned into a miniature hand. And then he had he had pants for his fingers. He had finger pants. Yeah. What? What is that? How did that What? Wow. Okay, they're they're full size here. Alright, Zach, see what you got. Okay. And then okay, he's full size human. And now he's not. Guys, let us know if you know how they did this. So maybe Zach King transformed into his own fingers. Hey guys, let me know if you want to see me do some cool skateboard tricks. I can do this. I want to see it. Yeah, guys, Justin was working on this new trick. He apparently can backflip three times in a row off this skateboard. You never seen any. You never seen anything like this in your life. Check this out, guys. Justin's almost as good as Tony Hawk. This is called the thick flip. almost had it. Call me Tony Rock. That was pretty embarrassing. Hey Adam, look. It's Tony Rock. <laughs> Tony Rock. <laughs> <laughs> it's Tony Bob. <laughs> <laughs> it's Tony Fox. <laughs> <laughs> it's Tony Shock. Oh wait. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be rolling, rolling through the skate park. <laughs> you jealous? I'm not jealous of you. <laughs> Why do you stick? I'm not even jealous. Why do you I look stick cool. your tongue out yeah, like look that? Cooler. Really? I look cooler. Get this out of my face. Take it out of the trash. Huh? He walked into a computer and he's putting it in the computer trash. That makes sense. Cause you could take out the trash in a computer. He got sucked into the computer. Wow. How did he just walk into a computer? So I guess this is like, yeah, like some VR type stuff. He's in the metaverse. Exactly. He's in the VR metaverse, bro. Wow. wow. Nah, nah, bro, nah. Guys, let us know if you know how they did this. He's, I just said, he's in Facebook metaverse. That's scary. He's in the TikTok metaverse, bro. This makes sense though, because we go from being humans to being in like Roblox. That's what's happening, he's in the computer. Oh. But how'd he take out the trash in the computer? This is scary, bro. Okay, they're getting dressed. The sock ran away. Wait, where'd the sock go? He put, what? He just cloned his sock in the mirror. Wow. It's running away again, hurry up and grab it. That was cool. How? First off, how's the sock moving? That's some Harry Potter stuff right there. Yeah, and imagine if you could just hold up like something in the mirror, and then if you just hold it at the right angle, you get two of them. Bro, that's what I'm saying. How you got two Milkies? He has multiple milk friends. What? Yeah. What? Milkies lit. Dude, I don't understand how they just cloned it I hold it in the mirror. That doesn't make any sense. Yeah, guys, try this and see if this works. If there's a mirror at your house, like, I don't know. I've just never tried it. That's crazy. Have you tried that filter that turns you old? No. Do you want to try it? Sure, what do I do? Well, just smile and three, two, one. 
<laughs> Zach, check that out. Oh, awesome. Uh, Zach? Wait, me? Zach, look your face. Hey, why am I old? No, no. Hey, turn me back. Get back here, you fool again. I'm sorry. What? Wow, so he went in a time machine and became a grandpa. Yeah. Dude, the filter worked. <laughs> What's so funny? I wonder what <laughs> I wonder what Josh is gonna look like when he's old. Me? I wonder if you're still gonna be skateboarding. <laughs> Oh yeah! <laughs> With just gray hair? I'd be the coolest gray daddy to skate park. That is really scary, cause yeah, it made him like 80 years old. How is that possible, bro? So he's, he's regular age here, okay? Then they hold up the phone. He's probably already transformed. How? How's how? I think I know actually, bro. What is it? I think I know actually, bro. I'll be here, right? Uh huh. I'll be here. If you hold up like a foxy filter on a phone, check this out. I actually know magic. Watch. Okay, right here. Right here. Right? Right uh -huh. here. Right here. Right here. So pretend this is right a here. phone. Okay, you just took a photo of me, right? And now I'm foxy mode. Wow. How did I do that, bro? That looked so cool How'd on I camera. Do that, bro? How did I do that, bro? We definitely didn't see you Try. just put your hood on. I did. Let me show you one more time. So for those of you who missed it, I'm normal right here. Okay. Hold up the foxy phone. Whoa. Oh, you're yeah. foxy! You know what I mean? That's so impressive. Okay, playing mini golf. I'm really good at mini golf. Yeah. I'm super good. <clears throat> okay? What's gonna happen? What? Huh? Oh, come on. Alright. Time for the point nine iron. What? Whoa. No! What? What? Wait, what? Wait, what? My head hurts. So it's mini, mini golf. It's mini golfception. What? Okay, he's definitely just playing mini golf. You telling me that's just a tiny little table? All right. Time for the point nine. What is that? My brain hurts. No. <laughs> Pay very close attention. Okay. Take some come. milk. 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 Okay. Here, take some strawberries. They're making ice cream. Give it a little shake. Huh? And get a milkshake. What? 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 What is going on? Whoa! Okay, Milky, do you want to explain this one to me? Yeah, guys, Milky's favorite dance is called the milkshake. <laughs> the milkshake. The milkshake. Wait a minute. Okay, this all made sense until there's a cup in there. And the whipped cream. Okay. How has he got that power? I wish I had that power. Yeah, and he made a cherry out of the lid from the milk. I know how he did this. How? Inside the cup, there was the other cup already. <laughs> but he shows the cup at the start. No, he didn't. It had a fake trap door. Oh, the but then how did he do the whipped cream? Maybe That part, I don't know. It's like a wire in him that has like a whipped cream on the end of his finger. Maybe there's whipped cream in this little thingy. Don't try to lick the whipped cream off my thingy. <laughs> I know you will. I won't. I've seen you do it before. I won't. Although this little thingy <laughs> contains a lot of power. A lot. <laughs> okay, they're making pancakes. What is that? Oh, I get it. It's a batter. Get it? Because they're making pancake batter. Oh, that's a messy way to make pancakes. Batter up. There you go. What? Okay. We're done with the walk. Okay, that's the messiest way to make pancake batter. I get it, it's batter. It's bat, because you got a baseball bat. That's easy, bro, there's a trap door. Yeah, but think of how long this would take to clean up. And where is the trap door? It's under the bowl. So there, see, there's a trap door under the bowl. Oh. <laughs> but wait, when the when the kid like bats the batter into the, the waffle maker, how does it make the he waffle? He caught it, he caught it, it's batter. But it cooks so fast. Yeah. Like it's, it's fast fancy cooker. right now. It's a fast cooker, look, watch, boom. He cooked it. That makes sense. Too mean. Wow. Okay, so this one we actually exposed how it's done. Exposed. Yeah, it's just a trap door in the pancake batter, and then they have a really fast pancake waffle maker. Yep. Wow, so we actually did that one. Crazy. <laughs> no bongo. It's great, babe. Thanks. Oh. Oh. You wanna roll? Yes. Oh, it's a butter, please. Thanks. What? Why? Why he's sitting in a booster seat? Look like Adam at the dinner table. Wait, but when he started, he was normal size. 
So he's normal size there. So that's a fake chair. Okay. My brain hurts. Now he's in a booster chair. And now he's like way smaller, but he's still eating the same food. This makes sense to me. It's what Adam does at the dinner table. Wow. Sits on a little booster chair. That's what he looks like, guys. That's what he looks like. Yeah. Can't even reach. Can I have some food? It reaches like that. Yeah, me and Ghosty love sitting in booster seats. You know what I mean? Here, booster seats. <laughs> <laughs> so. I can book you on the Desert Dune. We got Paradise Island or Yosemite. Uh, Paradise Islands. Good choice. She's gonna okay, jump in there. Oh, right now we can down one way. See, oh, I knew it. Uh, wow. Okay. This is incredible. Where am I staying? What's the hotel? Uh, there's no hotel. This is a deserted island. What? What do you mean this is a deserted island? I, I need a bed. Get out of here. I need a plate. Doc! No way! And he teleported with the towel. Now, the first half, I know this. This is obvious, bro. What? This, this is easy. That's just a window. <laughs> oh, right. Okay. They're just on an island, and that's just a window. Right? I cracked the case. That's obvious, bro. But how did he vanish in the towel? That's the crazy part. I think that's the hard part. There's got to be a hole in the sand. He yep. slipped his way in there yep. like a crab. So, guys, that was easy. That's easy, bro. That's just a window. They're inside, and it was just a window. Yeah. It looked like a, it looked like a poster, but it was a window. They go outside. So, you're telling me he's built standing on a sand castle like a trap door. It's a trap door filled with sand that he activates really quick, and he disappears under the beach. That's it. Wow. So, we're getting good at actually exposing these. I think we got it. What do you mean this is a deserved island? I, I think I we got it. I need a plate. Yeah. Yup. Yup. Yeah. Yeah. There's a hole under that towel, guys. Breaking news. LA is being hit by one of the worst rainstorms in history. Zach, it looks like you guys are being hit hard out there. That's right. It is downpouring here in LA. As you can see, it's caused chaos. Uh, uh, what? Let's take a look at sports with Donna. Hey, oh, he was on the news. But, like, when the water hit him, he vanished. <laughs> Look at this. He vanished. Dude! I know what it is. He's made of sand. Oh! And he dissolved in the water. Sand man. Da -na 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 -na. <laughs> He's made of sand. Like, you know when a sand castle gets hit with a wave? Disappears. Zach King. Zach, if you rearrange the letters, it spells sand. <laughs> yeah. Nice try, Zach King, but you can't fool us. If you take the letters of Justin and rearrange it, it turns into magician. <laughs> You're not supposed to leave. I was at the beach. I built a sandcastle. A wave came over. Splish, splash. It was gone. Just like that. And what was the one we just watched? He disappeared in the sand. That's what I'm saying. He came back out. Wow. Once upon a time, there was a beautiful princess. Okay, okay. Once, she woke up to a wonderful melody. Okay, like a song. She went out to the balcony to see who was out there. Okay. And an evil wizard captured her. A pranky boxer. And locked her in a castle guarded by a dragon. Dude, the king announced that anyone who would free his daughter would be able to marry her. Okay, that's a good deal. Soon, the princess heard someone fighting the dragon. Okay, okay. She was looking forward to meeting the prince, uh -huh. but then three princes appeared in front of her. Okay. I came to set you free, said the first prince. Okay. I went through swamps and forests to save you, okay. said the second prince. I destroyed the dragon, says the third prince. Which prince should she choose? So two of these are not real princes, and one is the actual prince that saved her. So two are imposter exactly so who should she pick and marry there is a magnifying glass that will go over the riddle so it'll zoom in on certain parts of each prince one of them said i came to set you free uh -huh. now now this this riddle is a little bit too confusing so actually i'm gonna confuse it a little bit more by bringing my friends prince kooky yar <laughs> is he a pirate he's a prince pirate lord yar yar <laughs> Matey. And then we got Cowboy Prince Jimmy. <laughs> Yeehaw, partner. Yeah. Okay. And then we have Prince Foxy himself. <laughs> so the first person says, I came to set you free. That's kooky. Now, how does that help? That does not help 
me yet. But if the first prince was Kuki, Kuki says, I came to set you free. I am very likely to believe him because Kuki's my friend. Yep, I have a strong inclination it's already the first prince. But what about the second prince? Let's see. I went through swamps and forests to save you. Now, thank you very much for that, Prince Cowboy Chimmy. How do you know he's not lying? I don't think he's lying, but I will say I didn't know there were swamps and forests here. What if I back up the riddle? Do they even look like they're in a place with swamps and forests? No. It looks like a nice, happy little place with no swamps or forests. You wouldn't lie to me, would you? He says, nope. Okay, <laughs> okay. I'm gonna set these two aside. And now the third prince, Prince Boxy, says, I killed the dragon. And I have dragon's blood on my arm to prove it. Off the bat, I'm gonna say, Boxy, you're my friend and everything, but that was a little bit too blunt. I killed the dragon? I mean, that's obviously what a liar would say. So the magnifying glass on the first guy, he's got a sword that's bloody. He fought something. Okay. Or maybe he just spilled food on it. Has that ever happened to you? I'm about to to spill food on you! Maybe <laughs> you don't stop distracting me! <laughs> the second guy also has a bloody sword, and he's got a transforming potion. Huh? Okay, and the last guy has absolutely nothing. I don't think it's the third one. The third one looks like a liar. The first thing he said was, I killed the dragon. Mm -hmm. That seems like an obvious lie, and his sword isn't even bloody. It's probably not him. Between Prince Kuki and Chimmy with the red and yellow, I'm thinking it's probably the first one. What because I love Kuki, but also because what is the transforming potion for? It transforms you into something else. That's what I'm saying. It's probably the wizard. No way. You think the wizard is the second prince? I think so, or something like that. Wait, why would the wizard capture the princess and then transform into a prince to try and marry her? Because if he just forced her to marry him against her will, she would never love him. But now that he tricked her, now he's playing mind games. I'm gonna go with the first prince because he has a bloody sword, so I think he fought a dragon and he doesn't have some weird transforming potion. I don't even know what that is. Okay, Justin thinks that it's the first prince because the second prince might be the wizard and the third prince has a clean sword. And he's a liar. Okay, let's yep. see what the answer is. Okay, the third prince lied. There's no blood on his sword. Okay, okay. And he's not a real prince. He must be the wizard. No! You solved it! Wait, I'm actually 9 trillion IQ. It was Prince Kuki. Dude, it yeah. actually worked. Prince Kuki's gonna come fight the dragon now. Oh, well, yeah. no, I'm not the dragon. Yeah. Justin, yeah. Justin, Justin, yeah. what? Yeah. Say you're sorry. Says, I will not. <laughs> yeah. Let's go. Okay, Justin got that one right. Okay, now that riddle was actually pretty cool, but I'm going to come up with my own riddle and put it at the end of this show like always. And you're going to DM people to get it right? I might. Okay, guys, watch the full video and see if you can solve Justin's riddle. But for now, we're going to get into the next riddle, which is this sick riddle. Sick riddle. Okay, this one gets pretty intense. You ready? Okay. Peter was sick for two days. Okay. That's Peter. Okay. And stayed in his bed. On one of the days, he was robbed by a neighbor. The police narrowed it down to two suspects. Okay. Diana oh. and Anna. Dude, Peter. Both girls were out last night. Okay. They said they came home late. Okay. The police checked their cars in the parking lot. Okay. They knew that one of them came home earlier and robbed Peter's house. Huh? Who robbed Peter? Okay, now there's a lot of hints in the riddle. Can you figure this out? I'm gonna say it was Peter. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna lock that in for the insurance money. Yeah, we get it to, to frame himself. Yep. Now this person has blue shoes. Okay. They have blue and white shoes. I'm watching. I'm looking. And they stole a clock and a lot of other heavy stuff. I have deduced who it is. Who? To carry all this stuff, you gotta be Jack. Like really strong? Really like strong. us? Yeah, um, no, not like us. Oh. Between these two who was more muscular, I would say it is the girl on the left. Do you think it has anything to do with the color of their cars? I do not. <laughs> what if it's one of the police? So it's an inside job? It was an inside job from the start. <laughs> I've solved it. I've cracked the case. Me and Detective Kookie 
have arrived on the scene and cracked the case. Peter was never <laughs> sick to begin with. He staged his own robbery for the insurance money, dressed up as a policeman, and then rented actresses and three cars to film a YouTube pranky box video prank compilation. And that's the answer. Boom, lock it in. Cookie's gonna take that. He's gonna buckle his seatbelt. Click, click, click. And he's locked in. Wait. <gasps> Wait! What? Wait, Detective Cookie and I have actually, we actually think we're onto something. Really? Like, no trolling. Really? What I said earlier about heavy stuff was actually makes sense. You trying to confuse us. Cookie says, it did not work. I just looked really closely. Look at the green car. Notice how it is slightly lower than the other cars. Do you think it's whoever owns the green car because their car is literally weighed down by everything they stole? Yeah. That's a pretty good guess. Okay, yeah. we'll see what the answer is. Yeah. The answer is the robber was Anna because she couldn't open her doors if she came home late. So Peter was parked, Anna came home, got out and robbed him, but then Diana was the last one there because she parked too close to Anna for her to even get out. So Peter wasn't dressed as a policeman? No. <laughs> now Dustin got that one wrong. Let us know if you guys were able to figure that out. I thought that was pretty tricky, but it does kind of make sense because no, she couldn't get out. She couldn't get out of her car. And we're gonna find the next riddle right now, which is this it's police riddle. Police. Okay. Alice was a successful lawyer. One morning, Alice went to work and suddenly remembered that she had forgotten important documents at home. She decided to return home for them. No problem. When she was about to leave again, she heard a strange noise. Someone was breaking into her house. Oh, no. Alice immediately called the police. Good. That's what you should do. Help. Someone's trying to get into my house. Okay. Don't worry. We're on the way, yeah. says the police. The police came quickly. Yeah. Alice was ready to open the door, but she realized there were two policemen. One was standing near the front door and one was standing by the back door. Which police officer is real? Who is the real police officer? So she's walking. She went home to get some documents mm -hmm. and she heard people breaking in. Now, wait, there's the mail, mail slot. It's the front door. Oh, that's smart. It's gotta be the front door. Except there is no mail slot. What? What does the fact that she is a lawyer have to do with this riddle? Might be nothing, but it might be something. Now, it's funny that Alice happens to be a lawyer because, because I also one division of Justy Corp International Inc. is our law firm. So I'm gonna bring down to the stand Jimmy. <laughs> he says you have the right to remain silent <laughs> and not think <laughs> everything you do and say can be used against you in the court of thickness. You will now tell us the answer to this riddle or else face severe legal consequences. You're looking at about five to ten years here of not being thick if you don't tell us. Now, defense attorney lawyer Cookie is coming down from the stand. Defense interrogation master attorney Cookie is gonna whip out the Tata mirror of truth and friendship. This is Adam. Take a good, long, hard look at yourself. Do you want to be remembered as somebody who didn't tell us the answer to this riddle? Yeah, that wouldn't be that bad. The jury is gonna step out for a quick meeting. They are now conversing. <laughs> yes, they seem to have reached an agreement. The verdict? The verdict is here. Cookie is gonna take the Tata mirror and wow! Hey! Hey! Yeah. Hey. Wait, 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 wait. That's the Justin Just Chromey legal team for you. Justin, wait. How does anything that you just did help you solve this riddle? Dude, that actually just told me an answer, right? There. Do you even remember what the riddle was? Oh, wait, riddle? <laughs> We're not playing Guess the Price Food Edition? No, you have to tell me who the real police officer is. Between these two, you already know who I'm trusting. It's the thicker one. <laughs> I'm trusting the one at the back. So you think that the police officer who is at the back door, who is wearing not really even a police officer outfit, is the real police officer because he is thicker. He's thicker and also, I'm, the only real clue I have here is that in the beginning, she did see the noise was coming from a door with a mail slot. I think that's the front door. Yeah. So Justin is going to pick the guy on the right, the thicker guy with the mustache who is at her back door as the real police officer. Let's see if he got that one right. That is 
wrong. Whoa. A real policeman would not knock what on the back door. Mean? He's a criminal. He did not even have his shirt tucked in. He has no badge. The actual police officer has a real police outfit. It's impossible to answer these riddles because sometimes it is the most convoluted, ridiculous, open this door and the zombie comes out and the motion sensor brick. <laughs> like, none of those make sense. And then this is the most common sense riddle ever. I tried to make this one easy. Deposition deputy Jimmy says, how dare you? <laughs> After we offered you truth and friendship, <laughs> you play us like this. Okay, Justin got that one wrong. And we can go to the next riddle right now, which is this escape riddle. What? Okay, this is a simple one. All you have to tell me is who will escape. Oh, man. <laughs> okay, now there's two girls. The closer you look, the more details there are. There's a girl on the left who looks to be looking at the key. Uh-huh. And then the girl on the right is sitting there very frustrated and there might be some stuff on the floor. So you have to tell me which one of these two girls will escape. I'm actually gonna help you with this riddle. Okay. I have made for you a jail cell made of paper so you can see what it's like to be in prison. Now I'm inside a jail within a jail. <laughs> Let me out right now. Right now. <laughs> now Koki is gonna just slide through. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now he's free. Koki. Go get the keys and come back. He's like, I got it. I got it. He's gone. And then Cookie's gonna come back. Oh, he got the glitch. Yeah! I got a cosmic brownie. Wait. Yeah, wait, 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 wait. But the girls in jail don't have Cookie to help them. Well, then they're never getting out, are they? It's over. Well, I'm a lot of them will. Why? One of these girls will escape. You have to tell me who. Now, the girl on the left, she is looking at the keys. She looks like she's smiling a little bit. The one on the other side, she looks a little bit angry. Yeah, she's frustrated. She has a bowl on the ground. Uh-huh. A way to get... Oh, because... Oh, wait. She doesn't have a window. The other girl has a window. Oh. Wait, what if she, like, breaks the window with the bolt and then climbs out? Dude, I didn't even notice that. Okay, so this might be, like, two different jail cells. Yeah. The girl on the right has a window that she might be able to, like, climb out of. Yeah, exactly. Wait. I'm actually gonna escape. I got a bowl just like that girl. I'm gonna throw it at the window. Okay. Ah, ah, and then I'm gonna bring out these towels that I rigged together. Throw them over. Wait. She doesn't have towels and in the jail. And then I'm gonna actually repel down the side of the jail. I'm gonna send Cookie first. Cookie says, I'll see you later. He's repelling, repelling down the side of the building. Yeah. <laughs> and now it's my turn. Hasta la vista, baby. I'm gone. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. The lady on the right has a bowl and she has a window. Oh, wait. She could use these sticks in her hair. Uh -huh. To pick this lock, probably. Okay, it's either that or it has to do with this window and like the bowl somehow, but I don't think so. Okay, that might be it. You want to lock that that's in? That's what I'm thinking. Okay, let's see if that's the right lock, answer. Lock that in. Oh, I get it because it's a lock. <laughs> the answer is who will escape? The girl on the left by using the stick in her hair. Let's go! And she gets out. That doesn't make any sense, but let's go. Dude, you got it right. Okay. Nice. Okay, Justin got that riddle right, and we can on the next riddle right now, which is this vampire riddle. Vampires? Okay, now this is a pretty simple one. Uh -huh. Now, all you have to tell me is who is the vampire? Okay. Now, there's okay. a lot to look at. Now, uh, it looks like a couple is getting married in the middle, right? Yeah. yeah. And then there's two girls. Dude, they put you in the riddle. Do the thing. Do the, do the thing. <laughs> Yeah! Okay, okay, now let me look. Look, the girl on the left, very quickly, I'm like, that might be the vampire, because she got pointy fangs. Oh, she has fangs! Now, but I have also seen on TikTok, there's a trend where people flex their fangs. Yeah. Apparently not everybody has sharp teeth like that. You have them. A lot of people have them. That might just be normal teeth. I don't know. The guy looks like he's bit on his neck, right? Yeah, but he that might be a decoy. He could be the vampire. He, that's what I'm saying. Okay. Hey, I'm not gonna rule him out either. The bride over here. Looks pretty sad. She looks pretty sad. But wait, that might also be a decoy. I yeah. can't rule her out. The one on the right has blood on her mouth and pointy ears. But what is she holding? A purse. Oh, I can't rule her out either. It could literally be all of them. I have deduced. 
absolutely nothing. <laughs> the wife has blood on her. Yes. How do you think that got there? Let's be real for a second. Somebody bit him and he's bleeding all over her and other people. Now, naturally, I'm thinking it's her because she has blood on her mouth. How does that happen? Unless you're a vampire. Perhaps she ate ribs, which have a lot of barbecue sauce. She forgot to clean it off her mouth. I think that's actually it. I have actually solved it. Really? I've solved this riddle. This man went to McLanky. He ordered himself a nice 10 piece nuggets with the ketchup on the side. He was eating the ketchup, dipping the nuggets, didn't want to share. And one of the nuggets got caught in his throat. He's actually choking. <laughs> Hence him grabbing his neck. Uh -huh. <laughs> the wife is alarmed. That is not blood. It is just ketchup on her. This girl over here was secretly eating his nuggets. Hence the ketchup on her mouth. And this lady over here does not eat chicken nuggets. And that's why she's happy. Boom, I solved it. Yeah, just a little bit of ketchup from the nuggets. Yeah, that's all it is. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, 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 wait. How does this help you solve the riddle? Um, I mean, it, it really doesn't. Now I'm just thinking <laughs> about nuggets. Uh, let me ask you this. Does it have to do with chicken nuggets? No, I just told you it doesn't. Well, then I give up. I don't know. It's probably not the guy because he got bit. It's probably not his bride. It's either the girl with the pointed teeth or the girl with blood in her mouth. I'm going to say it's the girl with the blood in her mouth. Why is there blood on her mouth if she's not a vampire, huh? It's C. I'm locking that in. Boom. Okay, Justin thinks it's the girl on the far right. Let her see. Yeah. Let's see what the answer is. The answer is the girl on the right. Let's go. Blood Let's on her go. mouth. Go. Dude, and she bit the guy. Nice. Yeah. Uh, it's not ketchup, no! No, oh, Justin! Oh. Let's go! Okay, now Justin got that one right. Okay, Justin got three out of the five riddles right, which is over. I'm um, so you win! Oh, let's go! Comment below some prizes you want us to have next. Wait, hold on, hold on. I gotta show my riddle now. Okay, we're gonna put the riddle on the screen right now. If you guys can answer this, comment below what you think it is, and Justin might DM some of you. Okay, let's see what I want! Propelling down the side of the building, yeah! I still love you still, baby! Okay. okay, nice! Okay, if Justin wins, he gets to destroy Adam's iPhone. Let's go! Yeah! I'm gonna come in with Adam's iPhone. Wait. And call down my friend. You're not actually gonna destroy it, though. No, it's like a no, joke. No, no, It's a, yeah, it's a joke. Okay, Prince cool. Cookie's gonna come in. Uh -huh. He says, don't worry. Don't he's gonna worry. pretend to destroy it, right? Yeah. Yeah. And then he's actually just gonna whap Justin! Oh.